Good evening, teacher. Hello, Jose. How are you? Why so good, teacher? How was your day? Uh, it was really relaxing because I have a rest day today. So I just uh, went to do one payment and then I back to the home. And then I watch my I watch my my favorite team uh, play, and that's it. Then I stay resting in, at my home. That's great. That's great. Excellent. Yeah. So, um, tell me, what's the plan for the rest of the week? Uh, for tomorrow, I have to work at 8 a.m. So I have to be at home until I end my shift. And then, I don't know, maybe I go out with my friends because I rest on Tuesday. Uh, those are my plans. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. Okay, perfect. And well, tell me, I will. I've been wondering, what do you, what do you actually do? What, what do you do in your company? Okay, um, uh, customer service support. Um. The customer call you because they need uh, help with the, their subscription because uh, we provide a subscription like Netflix. It's a streaming content, yes. but it's a, a live content. So I gave the support uh, with tech support and customer service. I made about uh, the both things. Okay, okay, perfect. That's interesting. Thank you very much. Yeah. Ready for very tonight? Well. Tonight we are going to be working on speaking. We are going to be working on groups a lot. Okay, perfect. I'm ready for that. Excellent. Thank you. Let's see, Marta. Hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. I'm good, and you? Just fine, just fine. And tell me. The same story, was... teacher. Yeah, the same old story. What about your day? What did you do today? My day was a very difficult day. 
I have a complicated meeting, many things to do, and some interesting calls, but I am ready for the class teacher. Okay, perfect, excellent. And tell me, Marta, what do you have, what do you usually do for Christmas? I've been wondering. My work? No, in your house, in your family. What how do you celebrate Christmas? Well, uh, yes, we celebrate Christmas. Uh, but what date? Uh, Christmas uh, 24, um, New Year uh, 51. If we, we have a dinner, all, all family. Um, let's see, teacher. Okay, that's interesting. So you keep busy for Christmas. Yeah. That's excellent, excellent. Okay, let's see. Thank you very much, Marta. Thank you, teacher. Anna Claudia, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. I'm sorry, good evening. How are you? I'm, I'm fine, teacher. Thank you for asking. How about you? Well, you know, same old story, always busy. As always usual. Trying to do, <laughs> yeah, always trying to do something different. Like someone, I don't remember if it was Roxana told you yesterday, as a workaholic. <laughs> yeah, actually, I won't laugh it too much. <laughs> actually, I define myself as a workaholic. I'm always My God. trying to keep busy. I mean, I get stressed if I'm home doing nothing. Man, it's so boring. My God. No, also... You need to sleep, you need to rest to forget about many things. <laughs> yeah, but you know, there's always stuff to do. Yes, she I know. Didn't want. <laughs> I don't know if it was Roxana. <laughs> okay, and tell me, Anna Claudia, uh -huh. what about you? What do you do for Christmas? For Christmas? Well, yeah. uh, usually uh, we dinner all the family together uh, i have a sister she lives uh, on a different house she lives in opico and yes. what, uh -huh, what we do is at least for december the 24th we dinner uh, together my two my two ne nephews Yes, my two nep yes. nephews, sobrina, I siempre me confundo con sobrina y sobrina. Nieces. Sobrino, ¿verdad? Girls, ah, okay. nieces, my boys, two... nephews. Nephews, so they are nephews. So my two nephews, they, that day, they are like running and jumping from one place to another because they have their girlfriends. So they dinner first here and then they go out and they go to their girlfriend's home to dinner. And they eat like in three different houses a day. But we stay oh. here. We try to, mm -hmm, to keep together because the next day on Christmas Eve, in the, on December the 25th, my uh, sister, is my sister's birthday. So we uh, take advantage. We are all together. And then we lunch. A uh, special lunch on December the 25th. Mm -hmm. There's a cake and stuff like that. So the December 24th and 25th, we always know wherever you are, you must be at home because there are two celebrations together. Christmas Eve and my sister birthday the next day. Mm -hmm. That's it. Then for uh, for um, December the 31st for the, the last night of the year. Yes, we 
dinner, but it's not so special as December the 24th. Mm -hmm. And we thank God for everything we live, et cetera, et cetera. And that's it. And we uh, believe and hope that the next day and next year will be better and so on, so on. But we, we keep, we try to keep together at least on those two, two uh, special celebration dates. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, that's nice. That's nice. It's actually that uh, that phrase that you use is very important to get together with relatives. It's, mm -hmm. it's important, particularly because I mean, sometimes we keep so busy all along the year that the opportunities to get with them and to share special moments are not like common happens. Exactly. For that reason, uh -huh, I told you that we must be here on the 24th and on the 25th. <laughs> Wherever you are, you must be here. <laughs> mm -hmm. And that's it. That is how we celebrate. Excellent. Excellent. That's Thank just you, great. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thanks to you. Let's see who else is around. Erwin, did you fix your problems with the connection? Hi, good evening. Good evening. Yes, I remember I, yesterday I, was a hard day for you. Yeah, well, uh, I was, before the class, I was um, asking for help and Claro support uh, because I think that because of the wind or something like that, we are having uh, many problems with our connections. And another thing is that um uh, we are maybe six users here at home and uh, when everybody is connecting well, yes it's, it's very i understand difficult. you totally uh, it's uh, stressful when that happens yeah but they told me that they are going to send some technical support at home because uh, they they don't Solve the problem. Uh, by, they didn't. By, oh, they, they don't. They don't usually they don't. solve it. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah, I get it. Uh -huh. They need to 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 send the the technical people at home. Okay, perfect, excellent. Oh, Erwin, we are asking everybody. I'm. I'm taking a poll. What do you do for Christmas? Tell me, how do you celebrate Christmas? Well, um, as, as usual, um, we celebrate uh, with my family together. Um, for Christmas Eve, we have a chompipe in the oven. Turkey, <laughs> roast turkey. Yeah. Turkey. yeah. Uh, <clears throat> and uh, I am the chef. Of course. Oh, really? You cook? Yeah. yeah, I love to cook. I love cooking. I love cooking. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. The and, same every, as me. and every Christmas Eve, I have a different recipe for, for turkey. I'm sorry, would you mind to repeat, please? Yes, of course. Uh, I. I always have a new recipe for oh, really? how, to, how, to cook, how to cook the turkey. Mm -hmm. That's cool. So you like to be creative in the kitchen. Yeah. It's the same That's story for uh, New Year's Eve too. That's cool. That's cool. You know, I once told your classmates here, in my house, we, we divide the job, you know? They cook, I eat. Perfectly <laughs> balanced. Yeah, yeah, perfectly balanced. <laughs> yeah, sure. That's cool. No, it's just that I'm so bad at cooking. I don't know how to cook nothing. Okay. Yeah, like uh, when, well, the good thing is this, that my son knows how to cook. So if uh, my wife cannot cook, my son prepares a little something. If not, a sandwich is always a solution. Okay. Yeah, that's, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. It's a, another kind of sandwich too. 
Yeah, but I don't like that. That's okay. Remember, he doesn't like typical food. <laughs> ah, yeah. yeah. Some, some, right. some typical food. Some typical food. Not all of them. I mean, there's a lot that I like, but that one, I don't. Not my thing. Okay. Okay, perfect. Well, thank you very much, Erwin. Thank you, too. Okay, where's Yanira? Yanira, where are you? Yanira, hello. Hello, teacher. Uh -huh, I'm here. Yanira. Tell me, Yanira. Explain to me. We miss About you yesterday. What, teacher? We miss you yesterday. Well, well, teacher, yesterday I didn't feel bad. Then didn't I feel good. today, yes. But yesterday, no, because I had some uh, medical condition, then oh, I, get a, I get a, a pill and I'm sorry teacher, but I fall down in my bed and I don't <laughs> uh, uh, despertar. I don't wake, wake up, up again. <laughs> yeah, and okay. then I I'm got sorry, a phrase teacher. for you. I have a phrase for you. Okay. Like this, I had a pill that put me to sleep. Okay, okay. I had a pill that put me to sleep. It's well, correct. It's exactly that. I hope you are feeling better today. Yes, I feel better some somewhere, teacher, but I'm yeah. here for the class. I'm ready for yeah, the I, class. I was actually kind of worried because you usually text me when you're having some issues, but I was like, oh, mm, where's Janita? She went parrying. And I was like, man, you know, on a Monday, she <laughs> went to party. That's crazy. Yeah, in, in my sweet, in my sweet dream, yes, of course, teacher. <laughs> yeah, but I then I remember she's single, she's young, lots of money, no problem. Uh, ah, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 right, teacher, yeah, right. She can party all night long, and that's cool for her. That's nice. <laughs> ya quisiera. How do you say ya quisiera, teacher? I wish. I wish. I wish. You just say I wish. I wish that. <laughs> yeah, wish me that. too. Actually, me too. Hey, guys. Uh, okay, before we continue, please let me get uh, the attendance. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Present teacher. Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Erwin Francisco López Rojas. I'm present. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present, teacher, present. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present, teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Martha Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Thank you. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados is somewhere here. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. We don't hear you, Roxana, but I imagine you were saying present. Present, sorry, teacher. Present. Thank you. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. 
Present teacher. And Janita Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, let me just check on something. Okay, perfect. Let's see. We got some activities that I have prepared for today and they are uh, related to, well, mostly conversations, okay? Okay, now, the, one of the activities for today, I'll be giving you one question, but let me see. No, I still got 10 more minutes. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my bad. I got 10 more minutes of the, of the warm up phase. Let's see who's around. Ambar, hello, Ambar, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. What about you? I'm just great. How are you doing? Better? Um, so so, but uh, I'm better than yesterday. Oh, you got the flu? sorry. Uh, yesterday I was sick. Yes, uh, I I had fever and flu mm. and a lot of headache. And well, now my eyes burn for from the flu, but oh. I'm here. Yeah, I imagine. Yeah, when you are running a fever, it's terrible. It's pretty uncomfortable. I think it's, it's for the change of weather. Yeah, actually, the weather affects a lot of people like that. It's normal. That happens, you know? Yes. It's quite normal. Well, thank you very much for being here, Amber, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Susana, where's Susana? Susana. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Susana. You just remind me of the song, Susana. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fine, okay. thank you. Ready for the class? Uh, yes, teacher. Excellent. Tell me, Susana, what do you cook for Christmas? Um, uh, turkey. turkey. Turkey? Yes. Turkey, turkey. Turkey, uh -huh, turkey, and oh, rice, cool. rice, um, and, and sal potato and salad. Oh, that's nice. Uh -huh. It's a, oh with a with a potato with a apple. Mm, sounds interesting. <laughs> yes, uh, I. I don't like a cook teacher, oh, but really? I, yes, <laughs> but uh, I need, uh, but is uh, I cooking uh, the turkey okay. with my family. You don't like to do it, but you do it. Yes, <laughs> no me gusta, yeah. pero tengo que hacer. <laughs> yeah, that happens, I don't that like, happens. but I don't well, like, but. Uh, I, I, I somebody's said, got to do it. Somebody's got to do it. Uh, Alguien debe. Somebody. Alguien tiene que. Yeah, I, know. <laughs> I, I understand you. Hey, Susana, welcome to the class. Thank you. Okay, thank you, teacher. Let's see. Silvia. Hello, Silvia. How are you? Silvia, you around? Perhaps no. Okay, Roxana, hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Tell me, Roxana, how's Christmas for you? How? Sorry? How's Christmas for you? Mm, Christmas for me is a regular day because I usually work in this day at uh, 12 and the rest of the day I try to resting 
And for dinner, order something to eat because my in my house, uh, all the people works that day and we prefer uh, spend time uh, watching TV or I don't know, maybe uh, spend time with a table place, juego de mesa. How do you say juego de mesa? Table games, yeah. Table games. Table games. And something like that, teacher. We try to don't spend time in the in the kitchen and try to uh, visit the church and something like that. And the next day, the same. We try to uh, get in the lunch uh, and go out. Fuera. Yeah. And resting. It's maybe it's a boring day, boring day, but we try to rest in. That's cool. Yeah, I mean, you have to take your rest whenever you can, right? Yes. So uh, I try to. Uh, okay, to and different... now tell me, tell me, Roxana, how's different uh, to how was Christmas for you when you were single? Before you got married, tell me. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> that good? I was happy. You don't even remember? <laughs> wow, that was a wild <laughs> night for you. Well, I remember that sometimes I travel and uh -huh. I try to do that. Okay, tell me then. In which countries did you visit for Christmas? Did you visit for Christmas? The last time I visited uh, USA, I visited okay. Lax and New York. Okay, so you've been in New York for Christmas. That's crazy. Bunch yes. Of people. Yes, I spent that time place get in. Packed. Yeah, but I love New York and maybe I try to get some days in this year to visit New York but I'm not sure now ah, oh that's cool that would be cool excellent I need some days to rest in a lot yeah I can imagine Roxana yeah. thank you very much thank you teacher let's see Jose Osorio where are you my friend oh the right there Let's see, let me check on something that I got. Uh, oh, okay, no problem, no problem, because I just got it. I have forgotten. Let's see who else is around. Francisco, hello, Francisco. Francisco Eduardo, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Just fine, teacher. Getting ready for work? Yes, tomorrow in the morning. <laughs> oh, you got to, right now you're home. Yes. Uh, uh, today is my last uh, day off. Oh, so you, tomorrow, you start your shift tomorrow. Yes, teacher. Uh, the shift that I hate. <laughs> I know, waking up very early, it's crazy. I hate it too. Yes, teacher. The good for me uh, is uh, only two days in, in this week. And next, uh, I start the afternoon shift for seven days. Seven days on a row? Yes, teacher. Man, that's crazy. <laughs> a little teacher. <laughs> but okay. I, yes, yes, tell me. I, I, I used to eat that uh, uh, eh, how do you say teacher uh, al tipo de trabajo? Uh, okay, I'm used it to the type of, of job of work. Okay, teacher. I used to eat so, the, I mean, 
for you is normal. Yes, teacher. Mm, I, I, I think uh, uh, this chief uh, have, has a, a benefit because uh, if I, I need uh, to, how do you say, diligence teacher or? Errands. Errands. Yeah, if, if you need to run some errands, you can do them. Right? Okay, teacher. And uh, because uh, if I, I need uh, doing a, a, a how, teacher, the word? <laughs> okay, errands? Let me, let me text it for you. Okay, teacher. It goes like this. The expression is, if I need to run some errands, it is. If I need to run some errands, I can do it, right? Yes, sure. Okay. This is, is, is it the, the, for me is, uh, is the benefit is the benefit in order uh, because I wake up uh, later. <laughs> later. Yeah, I know, I know. Now, I'm asking everybody about Christmas. Tell me, how do you celebrate Christmas? I, well, well, usually uh, uh, the Christmas, uh, we go into my family. Okay. And in the um, in the thirty thirty one in the end of years this year. Okay. And now, uh, I, yes, yes, tell me. In, in end of year, uh, we we going to to my my my. Mother-in-law house. Oh, that's nice. It's so is the, busy. In the usual. <laughs> okay, in that's the, nice. That's nice. So you 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 celebrate with both families. That's cool. Yes, sure. That's a, this is the the idea. <laughs> and cool. the, the, cool. the next uh, the next day, twenty five or. Years of, of years, uh, usually we going to visit uh, uh, some place. Usually, oh, uh, nice. uh, 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 fresh, fresh uh, place. For example, oh, Salcuatitan, nice. uh, Este, or uh, Los Naranjos, is the usual. Oh, that's cool. I mean, it's nice, so you can relax. Excellent, excellent. Thank you very much, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, Wilfredo Guardado, I got a question for you. Hello, Wilfredo, are you around? Perhaps no. Okay, guys, let's see. Well, first activity of the night. Look, I'm going to give you one question. And from that question, I need you to create a short conversation, okay? So let's see. The question that you are going to have is this one. How much time do you spend on a computer? That's the question that you will use. I need you to include exactly that question as it is in a very short conversation, okay? It's going to be like a two, three, I mean, three participations per person is okay. You will have exactly three minutes to prepare that conversation. You are going to be working in pairs or groups of three, depending, let me see. Okay, let me create the groups. Let's see, let's see. 
Give me just a second. Let me see, one, two, three, oh. Teacher, I have a question. Yes, tell me. Uh, about the about this question, uh, when you refer to spend on a computer, spend time on a computer, uh, working or doing anything else? Up to you. How much time do you spend on a computer? It will depend on the type of conversation you develop with your classmate, okay? Okay. So the groups are ready. Please, you will have three minutes to do the activity. Let's do it. Hurry up. Sorry, <laughs> happy for what? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm just fine, just fine. Okay, we can start talking about uh, work. Just I. Okay. Oh, Jose Wilfredo, Maria Alejandra. I'm so sorry, Jose Wilfredo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry that I didn't, I didn't notice. Hi, Maria Alejandra, how are you? Nice having you here tonight. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Fine. Always a pleasure, my dear. <laughs> okay. Okay, so, yes? Uh, we have to create one conversation, and that conversation has to be involved that question, right? Yeah, you need to include it. You can start with the conversation, like, Hi, Maria Alejandra, look, I'm, I'm, you know, I've been wondering how much time do you spend in front of a computer on a regular day? Okay. okay. And then she's going to tell you that almost all day long, and you're going to ask her why. And she's going to explain to you, you see, easy. Okay. Really? And I, I did it for you. I'm going and to attend. I need Ooh, to attend. Guys, you are the Beach Boys. Yes. You work in El Tunco, Silvia lives in El Santa. So you are the Beach Boys. Okay. Silvia <laughs> doesn't. Do you recognize the, the, the reference, Silvia? What is the name? The Beach Boys. The Beach Boys. Mm, no, I don't know the place. Okay, the reference is a, it's a musical group. Really? It was a musical group, the Beach Boys, an old, old one. Oh, really? Long, long before your time, my dear. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, I'm so sorry to say it like this, Silvia, but a lot of stuff is a long before your time. You're pretty young. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm gone. I feel too old in here. I just got brought back memories. Cool, now I'll let you work, I'll let you work. Let me go check some other groups. Okay. Uh, a one quarter. And one and 15. Computer. Yes. And using computer. Uh, in my cell phone. Yeah, in my case is similar. I, I spend most, most of the day but working on the computer. Yeah, for, Fernando, I mean, most of your, most, most of your life is spent on the <laughs> computer. Yes, uh, yes. 
uh, since I wake wake up, yeah, until to I sleep. Go to bed. I will sleep. I, I go to bed. I go to bed. Yeah, yeah. All my day, I I spend time on the computer, but for work. Well, you know, for... I like working on the computer, and then I work. I spend a lot of time in front of one. But man, as many hours as you do, guys, I don't know if I could stand it. Yeah, but for entertainment or for, for funny, I don't use the computer for for that. Yeah, no, no, I understand you. No, you know what's my problem? It's not the screen. My problem is actually the 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 chair. Man, I cannot stand being sitting down for so long. <laughs> it's, it's complicated. It's hard for the back. Yeah, terrible for the back. Terrible for the back and for uh, for the hand, la, la muñeca, teacher. Oh, yeah, your wrist. Waist. Wrist, wrist. Let, wrist. Me, let me text it for you. The wrist. Sure, teacher. Yeah, for the race, it's, it's terrible. Yeah, Francis. Sure. Uh, how, uh, no sé si la pregunta es, sería correcta, es how much time uh, do you uh, sit in the chair? How much time do you spend sitting on a chair? Ah, okay, perfect, teacher. <laughs> for me or Fernando? Who are you asking, Francisco? Fernando or me? Uh, and you, teacher. Me, I mean, I will. I have to, to be sitting down like uh, when I'm working on the computer, like in this class, I have to sit down like for three hours for this class. Because after the regular class, you know, I gotta check the advances on the grades. I have to check the tomorrow's class, the, the lesson plan, and I have to wait for the video to, to, to convert to MP4, then to upload it to YouTube. And it, sometimes I finish 11 something. But besides that, on a regular basis, sometimes I teach, not all of my classes are online, but sometimes I have to. But man, after three hours, four hours on a row sitting down, my legs, my back, everything hurts. I mean, remember, I'm a teacher, and before pandemic, I used to be like always in in regular face-to-face -face classes. So I used to move a lot. I mean, for me, it's no problem being standing up and moving a lot, but to be sitting down, I get stressed. <laughs> I, I, can't I understand you. <laughs> yeah, it's and like when uh, you're yeah, um, idiot. Teacher, there is an, an idiom for uh, estoy en sus zapatos o algo así. Yeah, yeah, to be on your shoes. To be on your shoes, ah, okay. Yeah, I, I understand that, that yeah. stress. Yeah, and I mean, it's it's different because if you are used to, to, to be on the move, that's okay. But if you are used to be sitting down and then you have to be like moving, it's exhausting also. Yeah. Yeah, but I I try I try to to do exercise. I try That's to cool. to work up, right? Yeah. Uh, to do, let you finish to because 60 seconds. Out. Just to work out. Just to work out. Uh, I try to work up. Yep. Uh, That's okay. cool. I, yeah, uh, I try to work up uh, before start my, my job. My activities. Oh, that's nice. I, in the morning, I I had an application for, for with a challenge to to exercise. Seven, yeah, seven seven three seven. I don't know if it's a reto seven twenty-four. So yeah, I understand. I know which ones. I know the type of, of apps you are talking about. Yeah, they help. Yes, because the rest of the day I I only stay sitting. Yeah, must be crazy. Okay, guys, I'll leave you.
Okay, let's see. Everybody's coming back. Excellent. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Jose Wilfredo and Maria Alejandra, please. I want to hear you. Tell me, what was your conversation? Okay, perfect. Hello, Maria, how are you? Hello, Jose. I'm fine, and you? I'm really fine, so far so good. Um, and also, long time to see you. Yes. And in this time, I think that I was wondering how much time do you spend on a computer? Okay, I spend a lot of time of, uh, every day when I have to work because in my job, I use my computer all the time that, I, that I'm in. I use nine hours every day that I have to work. And then I have to zoom two hours um, when I take my English class. So I spend a lot of time. And what about you? Tell me. I was wondering too uh, how much uh, how much time do you spend on computer? Um, it's the same case for you. I maybe I spend uh, twelve hours. Uh, per day on the week and the weekend only uh, work at uh, Saturdays and spend only nine hours but it's a lot of time and I don't know don't have an option <laughs> okay perfect and uh, don't forget wear your glasses and Okay, my my break is uh, over and I have to back to my go. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, bye. Okay, uh, Maria Alejandra, it's the same as your case, okay? It's the same as your case, okay, teacher. Perfect, thank you. Erwin and Silvia, I wanna hear you. Okay. Hi, Silvia, how are you? Hi, Erin. I'm good, thank you. What about you? Very good. I was thinking that we we don't we didn't talk a, a lot in the last time. So maybe it's because we are spending a lot of time working and we work a lot on computers. How much time do you spend? How much time do you spend on a computer? No, that's right. You're right. We have been working a lot, so we have not too much time to speak because uh, I work too much and I have to use my computer the whole day. So in the evening, I don't want to see my screen anymore. That's why um, yeah. I haven't texted you. Okay. And what about you? Are you still working uh, with computers? Because you told me uh, one year ago that you were working with computers. Yeah, but my job is more on on site with uh, trying with real people and not it's not necessary more than two or three hours by by my job. Um, but I spending other two hours uh, at night having some uh, English classes too. Oh, the, but that's better. That's great. Yeah. Working most time on side. So, and I am also attending online classes. So I, I have to spend my whole day working um, with my computer. And at night I have to attend my, my class also, but that's cool. Okay, that's cool. Okay, nice to talk to you. Nice to talk to you. Bye. Bye. Okay. Your whole conversation, guys, was quite perfect. You can say nice to talk to you, and it's okay, but uh, it sounds better if you just say nice talking to you. Okay, nice talking instead of nice to talk. If you say nice to talk, you have to say it was 
or it's nice to talk to you, okay? But the most, the most accepted and correct one is nice talking to you. Okay, thank you. Thanks to you guys, both of you. Okay, let's see guys. I still got time for one more couple. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Martha and Janita. Hello, ladies. Hello. Hi. Hi, Janita. Hi, Martha. How are you? I'm good. What about you? I'm good. How long we see you, my friend? Have been a long time on my computer. Tell me. Well, I spend a lot of time on my computer because I start at work at 8 30 and finish around 6 p.m. But I don't turn off my computers and continue in that for to do something, personal thing. And then I take a class by Zoom and finish around 10 p.m. But uh, I use one hour by make a homework in the platform. Then I finish around 11 p.m. all day on week, but on weekend, I try don't I try and don't use the computer. I only use my my cell phone on weekend. And that's it. What about you? You know the same story in my case. I I wore around eight hours for day, um, two hours for my class. So. I I around the 10 hours per day in my computer is I have been a long time every day. Thank you, Yanira. See you later. Thank you, Marta. Nice to talk with you. Okay, perfect. Now I got a I got a phrase for you. You go like, hey Janita, hi Janita. Long time no see. When you use that phrase, you are saying, eh, hace mucho que no te veo, o que no le veo. Long time no see. Actually, the proper, the proper expression is, it's been a long time without seeing you. That's formal. But when you are among friends, you say, I get like, hi, Wilfredo, how are you? Long time no see. And it's, informal, that's colloquial, okay? But it's quite used, it's quite common, you can use it. Okay, next activity, let's see, yes. Okay guys, for the next activity that we are going to do is, uh, we are just going to do one activity from the manual tonight because we need to check that vocabulary, that's mandatory for me, sorry. And is this, if you go to your manual and we are in unit two in page number 18, you got building vocabulary. The marketing mix can be divided into four groups of variables commonly known as the four P's. Variables, sorry. Product, price, place, distribution, and promotion. Match the four P's to their descriptions. Check your answers with a partner. So we have here product, price, place, promotion. And then we have the activities that make the product available to consumers. The activities that communicate the product's features and benefits that help persuade customers to purchase the product. The amount of money paid by customers to purchase the product and 
the merchandise or services offered by a company to its customers. Okay, guys, you got two minutes to solve that exercise, then we do it here together. So, jump in, please. In the number one, the problem. Hello, hey. partners in crime. Hi, hi, teacher. Hello. How is it going? Hey, you know, it Janita, was... Yesterday, Marta told me, you know, Janita, she doesn't want to be in class. She, told she, was, going to, <laughs> she was going to take a nap. She's lazy. Yes. <laughs> Just say, it's not I, true, Janita. I it's feel good. Yeah, I know. I know, Marta. I believe you. The teacher is joking me. Teacher, the teacher, is liar. Oh, you are so bad. <laughs> I don't say that. <laughs> I don't say that. I, is I say it true? The is it true? The teacher is joking me. <laughs> I, I always... she didn't she didn't say it she just thought about it <laughs> teacher i always say the truth always yeah me too come on <laughs> teacher uh, yeah right of course of course yeah me too me too all the time all the time <laughs> of course of course is not true. I don't believe <laughs> you. Liars. Yes. Why not? <laughs> don't you see this innocent face? Uh, what? <laughs> yeah, right. Oh. Yeah, right, teacher. <laughs> you see, Martha went like. What? Where? Where? <laughs> oh, you are so mean. Where innocent let face? Let me see. Let me Where? see. Let me see. I need to work on my innocent face. It's like this. Oh, come on, Martha. Uh, I'm sorry, teacher, but you don't have a face like innocent, innocent face. people. I'm sorry. Yeah, I yes, do. sorry. I do. <laughs> I do, you see. I'm no, sorry, it's... teacher. Is it true, teacher? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that's so bad. That's so bad. Me, me, me have a face and uh, like an angelical not, not. face. Okay. Okay, guys. See you. Bye. Take care. Customers. The purchase. Teacher, I was about to ask you. I heard purchase and I, on my job, I listen every day to purchase. I don't know. Yeah, purchase. Uh huh. It's to purchase. Yeah. Ah, okay. Purchase the product. To purchase the product. Okay. We already complete the um, the parenthesis. What we what's think we're the order? What's the order you got? A uh, one four. I am sorry. One four. <laughs> wow! It no. was no. Three, no. four, right? Yes, three, three four, four two, two, one. Yeah. My God, I'm sleeping. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you gotta be, you gotta watch out, you know, because uh, in this type of exercise, uh -huh. water is always like, <laughs> yes. like perfect. I don't know how he uh, does it, but whenever we have this type of exercise, uh -huh. Walter's got the mold. He reads quickly. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, he does. He does. He's pretty good for this. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. And we already complete this. Just the number four. We need the exercise number four we need to do, right? Yep. Okay. We're done. Okay.
Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back. So now. Okay, let's see, let's, oops, not here. Okay, let's see, number one, product. Walter, please tell me, what is product? Sure, okay, what is product? Uh, the merchandise or service and offer it with company to this customer. Okay, the merchandise. Perfect. The merchandise. Number Check one, it. excellent. Number two, price. William, tell me what's the price? William. Price is the amount and the money pay. Let me make another image. By customers? The amount of money paid by customers to purchase the products. Perfect. Excellent. That's number two. Erwin, number three, please. Uh, number three. Uh, Price. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> Please. I, I, I wrote a letter D C A B. <laughs> okay, that would be C. Uh, okay, it's price. The activity is oh. that. Place, place. I'm sorry, place, place is A. The activities that made the products available to customers. Okay, perfect. The activities that make the product available to customers. That's number three. Excellent. Now let's see. Uh, Wilfredo, would you mind reading number four? That is promotion, please. Uh, Mr. Wilfredo, can you see it? Me or? Yes, yes, you. Ah, okay. L let me see. I have two choice. Which one? Ah, <laughs> Promotion, the activity that communicate the products, features, and benefits that help persuade customer to purchase the products. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, guys. Now let's see. That's the correct order. Oops. My bad. Now let's see, this exercise is for later. Okay, let's forget about that for a second. Let me get the attendance once again, man. Time flies by when we are having fun. Uh, Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Erwin Francisco López Rojas. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. 
Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Thank you. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Yanira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present. Thank you very much. Okay, guys. Now, the same idea, you go together working in with the same person. It's the only, the last activity you're going to do with the same person because then you're going to jump to work in a different group. And you got another question. Okay, let's see. You're going to talk about, you're going to ask each other this question. How much free time do you have? And then the second question, what do you usually do in your free time? Okay. What activities do you do? Do you, you perform in your spare time? Okay. Those are the two questions you have. How much free time do you have and what do you usually do in that free time? Okay, guys, you're going to be having that conversation for three minutes. So let's do it. Let's jump in. Hurry up, hurry up. I have a question, uh, teacher. Yes, are we? Uh, free time or leisure time? What's the difference? Uh, okay, well, if you got pretty technical on that, it's a big difference. Colloquially, we use it for the same. Uh, if you go socially on it, when you talk about uh, free time is all the time you have that you are not working. When you talk about leisure time, you are referring to the activities. You perform that, you perform in your free time, but they actually contribute to your building up as a person. Okay. So, I mean, here we are talking colloquially, so it's just about spare time. Okay. Things you do for yeah. kicks for it to enjoy. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Other person. Mm -hmm. um, yes, I think that I have a uh, most time free, but I prefer to sleep. <laughs> okay. Okay. Perfect. That's gonna be the the next question. What do you usually do in your free time? And you, how oh. much free time do you have? Free time. Free time. Okay. If we talk about free time, like uh, days off, I have two days off. One is Tuesday, and the other is Friday. I commonly. Uh, play soccer, uh, play video games, uh, go to the beach, um, what else? I guess that those are my favorite activities that I like to do in my free time. And also in your time with my family or friends. Uh -huh. okay. And we can, and uh, like that will, and uh, like will be a conversation, like gonna be a conversation. Uh, we can say like, hey, hello, Maria, long time to see you. And you are, and you are still working at the last show that you told me? I work in, can you repeat me please? You are working on the last job that you told me? Ah, I working in a broker, in a broker. Insurance company. Insurance, insurance company. Uh -huh. And the name is Multi Riesgos. Okay, you can say, yes, I'm still working there. And then uh, I can say, like, 
I remember it that uh, you told me that um, that company don't uh, give you a lot of time off, but how much free time do you have? Mm, I think that I, I have a much time free because I start my schedule a little late, late but other people and, and I have a two day off and the other people usually have a one day and half and half mm. and I do many errands with my family because I live uh, with my sister, only with my sister. And when I have a free time, I prefer to help in different errands. And all like this, a chauffeur for my mother and my granny. <laughs> And my mother said me for the Tuesday and go to the, I don't know, the bank or I go to the supermarket. In the Sunday, you go to the price mart. I don't know. On bank. Sundays. On Sundays. Go to the price mart or see my granny. But... I think that my mother create my plans. <laughs> oh, okay, perfect. <laughs> once in a while. Uh, once in a while. Um, only that I stay a lot of time with my family when I have a more time or free time. Uh, for this reason, because I live only with my sister and I don't know. I miss them. Oh, okay, perfect. Um, well, uh, what do you usually do in your free time? Mm. Well, I guess that you can ask me that question. Um, but how about you, Jose? What do you usually do in your free time? Okay. Jose, what do you usually do in your free time? Okay, Maria. Um, usually, I want I like to visit my favorite places. That can be the beach. Um, go out with my friends to enjoy a lunch or maybe play soccer. In sometimes when I have the time to do it, I do it. But if you want, we can uh, um, we can make we can make some plans, and your next uh, free time we can I don't know go out. Uh, okay. Um, for the for the Tuesday, uh, I. Come with my granny to uh, create a appointment in the Euro Social or okay, okay. Wow, and, Maria. Uh -huh. And then in the ah uh, in the morning I see my father. I see all the Thursday my father in the morning. In the afternoon. I stay with my mother or, or do different errands. And, but this Thursday, uh, I think that like this uh, is, come to the east. I don't know what is because he don't say me. He didn't tell me. He didn't tell me. And my mother say me that comes to the Van de Sal. And only have two plants. Uh -huh. you ah, okay. okay, perfect. Well, Maria, it was a pleasure uh, talk with you talking and to you. Uh, talking to you. And well, see you next time. See you later. Okay. okay.
Let's go back because I have a very special activity for you guys. Okay. <laughs> Danny. Danny's not here, Susana. Teacher, que me quedó a él de, de compañerito, pero no, no me contestó. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, guys, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. We are going to do something before we move on. I got something very special for you. Let's see. And I need you to please, please pay a lot of attention to next, to what I'm going to show you right now because it's very important. Let's see, share. Excellent, Mr. Jose. Okay. Let's see, guys. We got us this. Okay, human cloning should be legalized. I got a series of topics here. Okay, now, this topic it's going to be for, oops, my bad, let's see. Umbar. All drugs should be legalized. That's going to be for Anna Claudia. Come on, you are in the least order. <laughs> she know a lot, she know a lot oh, of that Oh, come topic. on, that's your topic. <laughs> we can switch yeah. it to one. Claudia, you must be careful. Okay. <laughs> Next one, this topic Claudia. is for Claudia Ramos. Okay. The next topic, juveniles should be tried and treated as adults. We are talking about delinquency here. This one goes for Daniel. Next topic, climate change is the greatest threat facing humanity today. That topic is for Erwin. Then we have homework should be banned. Okay, that topic is for Fernando. Then we have Schools should block sites like YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram on their computers. That's going to be Francisco. Next one. All students should have an after-school job or internship. That's going to be Mr. Osorio. Jose Wilfredo Ayala, school should be in session year round. That's going to be yours, okay? okay. Jose Wilfredo. Then, homeschooling is better than traditional schooling. 
that's going to be Lucero. That's Lucero's topic. Sexual education should be mandatory and in schools. Maria Alejandra, your topic. I don't know, teacher. I don't know. Uh huh. Yeah, no comments. Okay, next one is Marta's. Marta, you're going to be talking about cosmetic procedures should be covered by health insurance. Oh, you work on, on, on insurance, so that's going to be easy for you, Marta. Then Nicolas is going to talk about that all people should be veggies, vegetarians. This one is Nicolas. William okay. Rosales. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks to you. William Rosales, you are going to talk about euthanasia should be banned. Okay. This is William. And Roxana, you are going to talk about that vaping should be banned. Okay. That's Roxana's. Next one is uh, 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 Sylvia. Sylvia is going to talk about smoking should be banned in all public places. Susana is going to talk about that people should be legally required to get vaccines. Mm. This one is Susana's. Then we have Walter. Okay, oh no, this one was supposed to be out, sorry. Walter is going to talk about social media. Social media has improved human communication. This one is Walter. Then we have Wilfredo Guardado is going to talk about that the development of artificial intelligence, intelligence will help humanity. Humanity, that's Wilfredo. Next one is Shanira. Shanira, you need to research and talk about this. Okay, now what's the activity, guys? The activity is the following one. You got a topic. Thursday and Friday from next week, I will send you this, 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 uh, the topics, okay? Don't worry about it. I will share them with you. So next week on Thursday and Friday, you will have exactly four minutes, four minute stops. From two to four minutes, I need you to expose, to elaborate about that topic, okay? You are exposing that topic. You are in favor of what the statement says. Is it clear? You're going to prepare a presentation and that's the topic you're going to be talking about. Do you have any question? No, we are, no. We are supposed to defend this even though we don't believe on it. <laughs> yes, exactly. My God. <laughs> exactly. Don't worry, I'm going to play I am, I will choose for every situation, I will choose one of your classmates that is going to play devil's advocate. My God. <laughs> so we... whatever you are, you stand for, I'm going to be against. Yes, Amber, okay. tell me. Will we expose in this order? Yep, exactly in that order. Well, <clears throat> if you have any problem, 
If you have I any problem, first. you just let me know. You'll go first. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. But it's going to be fun. Don't worry, don't worry. It's going to be a good exercise. Okay. Now, let me explain you why. I need you to please, uh, I need you to be able to, to, not just to communicate on a regular conversation. I need you to please, to be able to expose, to, to mm -hmm. give us, to give a speech, okay. talk in front of people, okay? And I need you to be able to develop the, 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 the ability to think faster in English. How are you gonna do that? Defending that statement. You need to prepare a little bit. I know that is an extra activity that I'm assigning, but believe me, uh, if I do it is because I want you to improve. And this mm -hmm. type of exercises help us improve. Okay. Okay. Teacher, so just, excuse me. When? Yes. When next week. Next week. Next week. Yes, Thursday and Friday. Okay. I will divide you between Thursday and Friday. Okay, teacher. Yes, it's, it's a. Fun. I prefer it's a Friday. But it's a finish the next the next week. Uh, it's a finish the month teacher. Okay. But if you have if you have any problem, just let me know in private, and I can make a special program for those special cases. Okay. Now, ah, okay. something else. If you need, if you prepare something like if you prepare notes and stuff, you can you can contact me directly by by chat or whatever. And I can help you out. And I mean, not just necessarily during the class. If you are preparing something, I can check it out and help you out if you need any help with the pronunciation, perhaps the structuring of some ideas. No problem. You can contact me anytime during the day. Okay, guys? Thank you. That will help no. a lot. Yeah, yeah, sure. No problem. No problem. I'm always available. If I don't answer right back, just give me a time that I will all along the day, but I'll be like paying attention to that. So thank you very much. I know it's going to be a very, very interesting activity and I hope you enjoy it. Now, uh, we are going to go again to groups and have, oh no, 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 I had a question. Let's see, Wilfredo Guardado, tell me, what do you usually do in your free time? Um, let me see if on weekend, um, it is, it is um, my activity, it is out there. Um, in the morning, I help to my wife to clean the house. Sometimes we, we do together. Or I go to the market. And then when I arrive after go to the market, I we make um we cook um for for breakfast. Then let me see. Uh, sometimes I, I need to go, um, for example, pay some bills or I go to some, some to buy to something for, for our car. Then in the afternoon, always uh, Saturday, I go to play soccer in two, two times. Per month, I I go to I go to, to church and Saturday at night. And Sunday, uh, usually we go together to the church. And or sometimes we go to we go to go shopping or. Um we got to visit some some family 
but is this I, uh, this is the form that I, I spend my free time with my family. This is how. This is how. This is oh, okay, this okay. Is how. This is I how. spend the time. This is how I family. spend the time okay. with my family. Perfect. Thank you very much. Welcome. Uh, guys, I sent you already to the to the WhatsApp group the, the list with the topics, okay? So you can check out which is going to be your topic and when you are going, and so you can prepare. Let's continue. Let's see, let's see. Who is around? Mr. Osorio, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, now the question is this one. What do you usually do on your free time? In my free time, it depends, teacher. On what? Um, when I come back from work, uh, I only have two hours left to rest. And I take advantage to watch something on television and share with my family. If I have a little time left, I take a bath and then take a little nap in okay. if oh, because of in the, the class, weekend right? uh, generally rest yes and generally in the weekend i rest as much as i can teacher and watch tv and, and do some shopping and help with the uh, how do you say labores del hogar, teacher? House chores. Los lo quehaceres del hogar? Yeah, the house chores. House chores. Mm -hmm. The common uh, the common thing for a, a padre de familia. <laughs> okay, yeah, I got you, I got you. Thank you very much, mister. Mm -hmm. Okay. Claudia Ramos. Tell me, Claudia, besides swimming in the lake, what do you do on your spare time? Uh, I usually um, go to the beach and go to the mountain. I swim in the lake sometimes. And I rest a lot of time. <laughs> what do you mean by resting? Do you lay down and watch TV or? Sleeping. Sleeping teacher. So you take long naps. Okay. I take a long nap. Yeah, that's cool. Excellent. Thank you. Now let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Sylvia, what do you do on your spare time? Tell me. On my spare time? Yeah, on your free time, okay. what do you do? Yeah, um, I usually stay home, but I like to go to the beach just for a walk, or sometimes I go swimming, but it's not very usual. If not, um, I go to my best friend's house and spend my whole day with her and her family. And I go shopping almost every week. So that's what I do in my free time. Okay, well, that's perfect. Thank you. Okay. Now let's see, let's see. Hmm. Wilfredo Guardado, what do you usually do when, whenever you got free time? Can you repeat, please, teacher? What do you do on your free time, mister? Um, I help to my wife to do, um, for example, clean the house, and the laundry, and wash the dishes. Uh, 
And another activity, for example, on weekend, usually on Saturday in the morning, I go to the market. We, uh, we go together or, 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 or I go alone. Okay. Do you like going to the market on your own? Yes. Because I, 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 I spend a little money, but if I go together with my family, I have to buy something that it is sometimes it is not necessary for them. Okay, so if you go with them, you think that you're going to yeah. be spending more. Yes, poor my wallet. But okay, yeah, I know, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. <laughs> yes, teacher. But um but I talk with with uh, Amber that I I like to spend with time with my my children because um, for example uh, Monday Monday after classes we go to play soccer together with some with another friends and this I like to do it because it is a a good time with them. It is nice for me because it is it is uh, one of the activities that we enjoy to to do together. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, Mister. Welcome. Okay, now we go back again to working groups. Questions. Look in the chat in the Zoom chat. I got three questions for you. We are going to talk about the place where we live. So, what's your area like? You are going to describe. Do you like where you live? Yes or no, and why? What's the best thing about where you live? And what's the worst thing about where you live? Okay, so those are the questions. I know they are long, so you are going to have eight minutes for that activity. Remember, eight minutes. So please, let's do it as fast as possible. Any questions before I send you to the groups? No, okay, let's see. Groups are created, please jump in. Yes, teacher. We have some little problems. This is uh what are what's your area like? Yeah. Okay. The area where you live. Oh, you didn't have the questions here, right? No, no. Uh, tacos. Tacos. Yeah. Uh, a lot of restaurant or uh, Mexican food here uh, near. If you need uh, Chinese food, I have two, not three. I don't have like a word thing. For me, everything is good. Uh, I have good neighbor, neighbors. Uh, I have good friends. Uh, thank God my house 
is a good health, for example, or um, a lot of. Mm, yeah, uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> I would rather live in, in San Benito, teacher, no oh, yeah, in Soyapango. <laughs> me too, but what can we do? Uh, exagerado. Teacher, how do you say exagerado o demasiado? Too much. Too much. Too much. Too much. Well, uh, in something season, here is a... It's very, it is, it is so calm, calm in, at night and we, we can sleep very nice because um, I don't, don't have, don't have... Um, it's a much um, matter. Hey, it's games, a, all the games, all play. I guess so. I don't know how do you spell this word, but in, in which the word? Case, because in, in the movies, it use word word para decir bosques, teacher. Forest. The woods. Woods. Or the forest. Woods. Okay, what? What is different? Okay, hold on. Calm down, ladies, please. <laughs> okay. When you talk about, um, when you're talking like formally about forest, you're saying the word in general, okay? But look, you know, Janira, uh, in, near to my house, there's a little forest and I like going out to the woods. Okay, okay. You get the idea? Yeah, yeah, because in the forest you see the goods. Yeah, exactly. But if okay, you refer okay. the, the specific but, word but, is but, forest. Okay, okay. I understand, I got it. For example, who's, in my who's house. Who's got a forest near, near your house? You got? Yes, yes Janina, teacher. Oh, yes, she sure, lived, sure. She lived in sure. the... Yeah, yeah, How do you no, say no. mansiones? Yeah, that, there's, oh, there's, there's, Jesus, there's levels on, and categories, Martha. Yes. No, it's not true, teacher. Neighbor, this happened. many forests, teacher, when she work every day with your pets. Yeah, I know. I know what's mm -hmm. you know, you know, other other level. Yeah, I, actually, I this do. This is not do. true. Yes, it, it, this is teacher. not true. Really, I, yeah. in no, front I, of my I, I house, can, teacher. I could believe it. I could believe it because I know that there are many, many neighborhoods here in El Salvador where, I mean, they are like that. Well, not too many. There, but there are some that are like that, you know, and those areas are for people with money. Yes, many well, well to do people, well to do people. Yes, teacher, other level, you know. Come on, it's not true, it's not true. Yes, this happened true. in front, in front of my uh, house is a small mm -hmm. forest. Then I can. She have pool in your neighborhood. In her neighborhood. And yes. She, the she's I, swimming I, I got a, every I got a, weekend. I got a plastic one like this, you know. They call them wakal. <laughs> yes, and security <laughs> in your neighbor is a very in her, very, in her neighborhood. In her neighbor. Neighbor is a very um, strict, heavy, heavy, heavy. Oh, really? Because, well, yeah, yeah. Because of you, the people. Yes, you can uh, pass to yeah, you, you know. security. Oh, really? Yes. You uh -huh. know, here, I, I don't know. I live, here, where I live, you have to pass for many security too. But the other type. 
<laughs> the voice teacher, the oh voice. Oh my God. <laughs> and, uh, actually, where I live now, we don't have that problem. Where I you live, pay, I said, you pay oh. teacher? Where I live, the, the neighborhood is, is small, actually. I mean, we just have like one, two, one, two, three streets, four streets. That's the whole neighborhood. But it's gated. I está cerrada. So we pay people for to 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 open security. and close the doors. Yes, security. Oh. And and it's cool. When uh, some years ago we decided to do that, and it has worked perfectly because I mean here in the neighborhood you can walk around like 11, 12 p.m. No problems. And sometimes I go to my in-laws, that's three blocks from here, and we leave our door open, unlocked. And not a problem. I leave really? the car up. Yeah, I leave the car unlocked sometimes at night. I got I got mm -hmm. one car in the in the street. Sometimes I leave it in the street because uh, man, I need to 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 do some things with the other car in order to get them both on the garage. And sometimes I'm lazy. Oh. And I leave them oh, unlocked cool. sometimes. And there's not a problem at oh, all. Like, Jesus. In, in my older house, Jesus is very dangerous. This is a reason that I I take a decision that move on this place because it's very dangerous. Dangerous. You know, teacher Soyapango is is uh, it's not a good place for, for you. Come on, I grew, up in, I, I grew up in Soyapango, Shangela. Soyapango is beautiful. I love it. <laughs> yeah, but it, it's dangerous, teacher. And I live between uh, uh, San Jose and Conacastes. You know, this place is, is, is really dangerous. And in my older um, that was Montes. Montes, yeah. Then in how do you say passages, teacher? Oh, the thing is that in English we don't really, really have that word. <laughs> yes, I know, but but this is a point. Uh, Ali. In, yeah, I know, I know, I know. The first, I I grew in the up first walking there. Is, one one gangas and the last passages another gangas then you know it's very dangerous you need to you have the same security on your <laughs> on your neighborhood and when something uh visit visit me yeah. visit us, visit me. me when someone visit me this remit need need to show the the duty. You see, very good security. Need to show the the duty. <laughs> That's very strict security. Yeah, you know. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. I grew up. Yeah, I grew so up walking in in Soyapango, and I mean, uh, I know what Soyapango is like. Some areas, like uh, I grew up in Bosque de Cruz. Yeah? Mm, yes. It's another yeah. place, but it's but it's not all places. It's in some areas. Certain specific areas. Yes, yes, in the specific areas. Just the problem that I live in between them. Teacher lost, my friends. Yes, the teacher is gone. And then, what so is sorry, the next guys. question? So sorry, so sorry. Teacher. Don't worry, don't worry. I think my better half is a little bit sick. Who is sick? My better half. Mm -hmm. 
My per half. What does mean, teacher? Mi mejor mitad. That's a way to, say, oh. to refer to your to your partner, to your wife. Yes, I know, I know. Oh, she's she is sick. Yeah. Flu? I don't know what's wrong. Uh, uh, I mean, maybe I, it's a virus. Yeah, but I'm ready for later, you know. Ah, uh, teacher. <laughs> teacher, come on. Teacher. The teacher, the be, teacher be wants young, be, to, to sleep with the dog. face. What happened with the innocent <laughs> face? Come on. The innocent face, face is come on. on. <laughs> all the time. I Maybe know. all the time. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I'll see you in the main room, guys. Okay. Walter, I didn't ask you, how was the final? Who won? Yes, teacher. I, uh, I'd see. <laughs> and oh, see. you just had to smash. <laughs> yeah, you didn't play. Yes. You yes. were like, man, I wanted to play. Oh, yes. Uh, I know, and I know. Preparing, then preparing a new... Um, Tournament. A new... Tournament, oh, yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, they start the tournaments and ten uh, eleven December. Okay, it's close. It's close. Yes. Very close. Yes. Okay, let's see. Well, thank you, Walter. Welcome to you. Let's see. Hey Nicolas, how are you? Hey, teacher, how are you? Good evening. I'm just fine, just fine. Good evening, Nicolás. How's everything? How was the drive? It was a long drive. What time yeah. did you What time did you leave uh, uh, the border? Well, the town where you were working. Well, uh, the, the, the time is, for example, San Salvador. Uh, no, what Japan? time? Look at me. What time did you leave? A que hora salió? Uh, I left more or less six o'clock. Okay, what time were you in your house? Nine? Uh, well, I, I, the, for example, uh, I, my problem is for the, the access, for the access, uh, there's a teacher, how do you say this? From, 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 from uh, Chawite. Uh, uh, Chawite is a community in, in Tacuba. Uh, is one hour, the Chawite, Tacuba, one hour. And uh, 30, 30 minutes, Tacuba, Huachapan, and Huachapan is about two hours. Uh, are two, three, three, three hours more, more or less, three okay. hours. Is, and I, I drive um, fast and the time is, 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 is a little, is, is menos, is menos? It's less, it's less. It's less, it's less, it's yeah, less, it's less. less. I watch a pan San Salvador. Uh, yeah, but still it's hard, it's hard to drive. Uh, I mean, after after working all day long, it's terrible to drive a long distance. Yes, I I am I am tired. I am tired. I I I was drive 
all all the all the morning and and, and then uh, all the way back from from there to san salvador that must have been uh, crazy. from san salvador i i drive uh chawite um, our japan and our japan san salvador other other partners in san salvador i i returned the drive i the, the a return to drive. Oh, you were taking turns. You were taking turns. Se estaban turnando. Yes, yes. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's only, cool. only in the return. Only in on the, the way there. On the way there, just you. Only, only, so uh, only, only, only oh. me. That's hard. Thank you, Nicolas. Oh, thank you, teacher. Nice to meet you. Okay, guys. Well, I hope you have liked the activities today. Tomorrow, I will start my class asking you about these questions. What's your area like? Do you like where you live? Why? That's going to be our warm up to begin the class. Okay. That's what we are going to do tomorrow. I will start asking you directly. Some of you, I will pick some of you to ask that, those questions. And again, tomorrow we are going to have a class like today. A lot of conversation and a little bit from the book but mostly we are going to focus on conversation is it okay with you guys do you like it like that yes teacher i like it. yes teacher yes. okay teacher perfect Fine. excellent really excellent. good excellent if you have any suggestion remember you can text me directly and no problem i take all suggestions let me get the attendance one last time before i send you to sleep Let's see, Amarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Claudia Lizeth Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Thank you, Daniel. Erwin Francisco Lopez Rojas. Present. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Roxana Ibet Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Chanira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Okay, guys. Please don't forget. Uh, sorry, I will switch into Spanish for a second. Voy a cambiar a español un momento. Eh, recordatorios, por favor, no olvidemos el trabajo en la plataforma. Algunos todavía venían un poquito atrasados. Eh, los temas que mandé, recordemos, son para la presentación que vamos a hacer la próxima semana de, tres, de dos a dos. Cuatro minutos máximo. Be ready. You can contact me any doubt. Thank you very much. Have a good night. Teacher, y con la plataforma yes. esta semana vamos a hacer hasta cuál? Al 2.5 o hasta cuál? Porque esta semana va uh, dos videos. Una... Yes, like that, like that. We are going to be going like that. La misma plataforma nos va diciendo. Ah, ok. Okay. Esta sección 2, profe, termina de este viernes al otro, ¿verdad? Yes, exactly. And, okay. Y para esa fecha vamos a tener que tener para el, la sección 2 y el midterm. Yes. Ah, thank you. Okay, thank you. Good night, good night. 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 Good night, Fernando. Enjoy it. Bye, Shanira. Bye, Roxana.
well. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.